what a September to remember for the Dudley family. So now it is time to move on into October, the month of October. Let's see what storyline we're going to be involved with this time. A Hell in a Cell match versus Hardcore Holly. Thank you. Finally, something different for once. It's about time. Oh, classic rematch. Takamichi Noku versus Grandmaster Sexay. Oh, Grandmaster Sexay ended up getting his payback on Taka. <laughs> he got his revenge on Taka for Taka defeating him for the light heavyweight title. I mean, it would have been actually been quite hilarious if that was for the light away title. Oh, it's Hardcore Holly. Oh, wait a minute. I think I know what this is. We've seen this before. Oh, no! Hardcore Holly's being beaten up! By who exactly? There is no one to be found. But Bob Holly lying on the floor. In front of the door. Same thing happened with Farouk. <laughs> but wait, it looks like we're going to be dealing with some more uh, created uh, stuff. But wait, uh, am I not going to have a Hell in a Cell match, though? Then I want to have a Hell in a Cell match, please. I want Hell in a Cell. Deal of Brown versus Test. And... Deal of Brown has passed the test. He has passed the test, all right, with the comeback. The comeback, he has passed the test. So what's going to happen now? It's me. Who is that? Yeah, it's another uh, creative guy. It's a masked guy this time. So it looks like we have a chance to... Uh, get some more created uh, parts. But what match am I going to be in? We'll know it. We won't know until later. <laughs> it's the Main Street Posse versus the uh, uh, Stooges. Rodney and Joey Abs versus Briscoe and Patterson. <laughs> Main Street Posse versus Stooges all over again. And the Stooges win! <laughs> the corporate Stooges win! <laughs> oh boy. I must have twisted my knee pretty bad. <laughs> Did you get attacked in the knee there, Bob Holly? Was someone actually a lot more hardcore than you? Alright, triple threat match. Eddie Guerrero, Christian, and Crash. Two dead wrestlers. Two of these guys are dead. Is going to be Crash Holly. Crash Holly was the victor. Then it is just going to bring up something happened in the back, and Hardcore Holly is unable to compete in tonight's match. Apparently, there has been some sort of accident backstage, and Hardcore Holly will not be able to compete in tonight's match. You had JR and uh, Jerry the King Law look pretty. <laughs> the, uh, the design on that looks, you know, looks pretty weird. It looks like they're, you know, kind of like a, you know, paper design. Krangle versus Mankind. All right, Mankind. And Kurt Angle wins. <laughs> After all that, Mankind still did not win. All right, my brothers. We got a cage match. Another cage match against another unknown character. Man, what's up with the cage matches? I want a Hell in a Cell. So my brothers, the Dudley Boys versus RTC, Stevie Richards, and Bull Buchanan. Jeez! Looks like the RTC have censored the Dudley Boys. Man, they have successfully censored the Dudley Boys. Wait, does that mean the Dudley Boys have to join the right to censor? Vince McMahon is making changes to the match. Ah! Ah, that damn David Lee Dudley Dudley! <laughs> Been winning too many matches as of late. So he's not gonna have a Hell in a Cell match, he's gonna have a cage match. Ah! Ah, I'm the boss! 
I'm the real big boss man. Damn it! <laughs> so yeah, you do not make any changes until I don't know. I forgot when the yeah, the change in the match actually does take place. So it's me against unknown Q. Yet another cage match for more creative parts. I mean, seriously, why does it have to be, you know, keep being a cage match? But at least we're going to be seeing some high-flying action. That's for damn sure. That's for damn sure. So we'll be able to see some more high-flying moves off the top of the cage. <laughs> like, how about that diving moonsault I did one time off the top of the cage the last time we did this? <laughs> but still, I want to have a Hell in a Cell match. Hell in a Cell match is far more entertaining, in my opinion. I mean, you can drive your opponent through the center of the cell and into the ring below. You could do a lot of stuff in a Hell in a Cell match. What? I mean, I don't want just just constant cage matches. Oh, it's the bike! A masked man riding a boat. Uh, he's he's coming out to the Undertaker's uh, entrance. He's riding a bike. It's basically the Undertaker, the badass Taker entrance. But it was cut short. All right, masked man, come get some of this. Yeah, that's right. What are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna do about it, huh? I got you. I got you. I got you. Ah, I couldn't shake, rattle, and roll him. Kick to the groin. Ouch. Nope, you're not getting up. You're not getting up, pal. <laughs> you're not getting up. <laughs> nope, I got you stuck to the ground. Nope. Oh. <laughs> I kind of had him cornered for a second there. I'll just keep cornering him. <laughs> Shame I couldn't get him in the shake, rattle, and roll. Dragon Sleeper. I gotta put him out so I can do an insane aerial move off the top of the cage. I gotta do it. Oh, Spine Buster. Man, no sell it. I want to do like another Moonsault off the top of the cage. Another diving Moonsault. I gotta knock him out though. Oh, Jackknife. Boom! I can't do that when he's like that. He's gotta be on his back. Alright, here we go. No, he's not even out of it. Drop down. <laughs> I hit him with an elbow on the, on the way down. That was awesome. I don't think I've ever done that. That was actually really awesome. All right. He's out of it. Ah, oh, did I? <laughs> well, at least I hit him on the ground. I forgot. It's supposed to be the square button to go faster. I forgot square buttons to move faster. Ah, uh, no, no. Ow! <laughs> All right, fine. Do I have to give him my scissors kick? Not that kick, but the scissors kick. But then he's going to be lying on his stomach. So I can't do it like that. I'll just keep laying it into him. Because I want to do at least one diving moonsault off the top. Man. Come on, stay down. We're supposed to... Ag we agreed on trying to do this spot, okay? I called for the diving moonsault spot. I want to do it. Come on, pal, just stay down and we can do this diving moonsault spot and get it out of the way. Diving moonsault off the top! Hit it! Yes! <laughs> I got it! <laughs> that's it. That's it. Just gotta knock him out and that's it. Boo! We're out of here. We're out of here. That was a spot in the night right there. See ya. <laughs> oh, man. Diving moves off top of the cage yet again. <laughs> that, sh that was supposed to be the finish. Sometimes I wish the diving moonsault wasn't always a pin. It, it would have like a uh, animation, you know, tell you, oh, you hit the move correctly or at the right, you know, at the right uh, positioning. So um, it gets like that animation and it counts as the uh, per you know direct hit, you know. But unfortunately, it's always a pin in this move uh, the, in this game. 
I felt prepared for this match. I went out there and did what was needed. The challenge was great and it really brought it out the best in me. <laughs> Same response as the last time. Same finish. Same finish with the diving moonsault off the top of the cage. Resulted in me in my victory. But it wasn't the main event. Alright. Battle Royal. Vince McMahon, Billy Gunn. Oh, Al Snow won. What? Al Snow won that? <laughs> well, hey, at least Vinnie Mac didn't win. So, we got more creative parts. Awesome. <laughs> what the heck? Man. At least we got more stuff. It's better than nothing. Alright, week two of October. Seriously, book me in a Hell in a Cell match or something like that. <laughs> Stevie Richards? <laughs> I got a match against Stevie Richards. But of course, the ladies first. Women's championship between Lita and the cat. To start us off. Why are they booking me down at the bottom of the card? I've had main event match after main event match. Yet they're still booking me at the, bot at the bottom of the card. And I'm talking with Bull Buchanan. Hey, I'm actually planning on betraying Stevie Richards. We're going to screw the right to censor out of this. <laughs> I want to I want to get back to my SWAT attire, so please help me out. <laughs> Women's title. Lita versus the Cat is going to be the Cat, new Women's Champion. New Women's Champion is the Cat. All right, here we go. Singles match. Me versus Steven Richards. Bull Buchanan has agreed to interfere in my match, so that way we can cost Stevie the match and uh, officially disband the right to censor. We are going to disband the RTC. This will also serve as payback for what Stevie has done to my brothers. That Stevie Richards is gonna pay. Warning. 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 <laughs> you know, sometimes it just makes me think that the right to censor would have had a different theme besides that, you know, just, just, you know, a siren going off uh, sometime after the song starts, the drums will join in, you know, and uh, as well as a monotone sounding warning. <laughs> ah, come on. Gotta get the shake, rattle, and roll on him. Got him! <laughs> shake, rattle, rock, and roll. Boom! I just love that move. <laughs> Got you, Stevie. Hey, Stevie? Come on. Ah, he blocked that one. Get out of here, Stevie. Get up, Stevie. Come on, Stevie! Up, oh, <laughs> boss man slam. Boss man uh, sidewalk slam pin. Ow, Stevie! Stop it! Stop it, Stevie! <laughs> he just did like a miniature version of his Stevie kick right there. <laughs> Come on, Stevie! Get out of the ring! Get out of my ring! Asai moonsault. Gotcha! Plant your face on the barricade. Come on, plant your face on the barricade. Yeah! Ow! <laughs> Sai Moon's ult. <laughs> he was trying to do his taunt. He was 
trying to do like some, some silly taunt. Famous sir. Let's do something crazy. Diving at but oh to the floor. To the floor. Luthez press. Ah, oh, I didn't dodge that one. What are you trying to do, Stevie? What was that about? <laughs> one, Stevie. Stevie? <laughs> Stevie. Come on. Pwah! <laughs> oh, man. That's Bull Buchanan. Ah! <laughs> Bull Buchanan has agreed to help me, Stevie. He doesn't want to be a part of Rise of Sensor anymore. Come on, Bull Cannon. Get him. Scissors kick. Booyah. Now it's my turn. Double scissors kick. Ah, oh, I didn't knock him out. Get him away from the ropes. Yeah, we got him. We got him. Yeah. <laughs> All right. The RTC is not fine. It is done. The RTC is finished. The plan worked perfectly. Just like we planned. <laughs> it all went according to plan. With Bull Buchanan joining me, taking off the suit. He wants to he wants to wear his SWAT he wants to wear his SWAT attire back. He wants to wear his SWAT attire again. <laughs> Pat Patterson versus Bradshaw. Seriously, why am I booked lower on the card? Main event match after main event match, but then the creative writing is like, ah, screw that. Those main event matches don't mean anything. So it's Grandmaster Sexy versus Dean Malenko for the light heavyweight title yet again. Grandmaster Sexy retains the title. And that's going to be Kurt Angle versus Kane. It's that uh, WrestleMania 18 match. <laughs> All right, yeah, 18. And Kurt Angle wins. <laughs> Hardcore match. Steve Blackman versus Edge. It's going to be Steve Blackman. I'm still happy that Devon Dudley now holds the Hardcore title. My brother, testify. Taz versus Al Snow. I can't believe how they completely screwed up Taz in the WWF. Last but certainly not least, triple threat between Stone Cold, Road Dog, and China. It is going to be Road Dog. Oh boy. I think that was the first time Stone Cold, I've ever seen Stone Cold not win a match. I could be mistaken, but I think that was the first time I've ever seen Stone Cold not win a match. All right, week three. Now I'm against Jeff Hardy again. <laughs> Light away title rematch. Grandmaster Sexy versus Dean Malenko. So we're starting off with Joey Abs versus Bull Buchanan. What is he? What is? But then again, Bull Buchanan's not part of the RTC anymore. Hell yeah! Bull Cannon wins, my man. I was gonna say, shouldn't he not? Should he be ditching the suit? The RTC is finished. So what's he going to start off with this time? Oh. Yeah. Of course, Jeff Hardy wants to continue the feud where we left off. He wants to bring back the feud. Oh, yeah! My brother! <laughs> David Lee and Devon Dudley are heading for the ring. Looks like Jeff Hardy wants to uh, pick up the uh, his him and uh, the Hardy versus Dudley's feud back up again. Fine. Oh, man. Excuse me. Another long night. Albert versus Pat Patterson. Yeah, that's a really strange shot of Pat Patterson. And Albert wins, of course. Light heavyweight title rematch. 
But since when did he get a title rematch so soon? This has been two weeks in a row where the light heavyweight title was on the line between these two guys. Dean Malenko really wants to have that light heavyweight title back. And it's me. Oh, who's that? Oh my, David Lee Dudley is being attacked by Jeff Hardy. With a sledgehammer to the back, no less. Is this going to be the brawl? Uh, it looks like it. Yep, yeah, yeah, it is. It's a one-minute brawl. Get in the forklift. Get in that forklift. Forklift. Come on, get in the forklift. Ah, I did not want to do the taunt. Oh, no. Just wanted to get into the forklift. Dang it, Jeff Hardy. Stop it. Stop it, Jeff. Get over here. Man. Man, Jeff. Can't do anything. Oh, yeah, you can't get him on there. I have 40 seconds. I need to get my finisher on him. Man, he's not selling anything. Jeez. He's not even staying down for a long time. Man, I gotta do it quickly. I'm not gonna be able to have enough time. Whatever. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> Whatever. <sighs> My head get, just keeps itching. Unfortunately, I was not able to land my finisher. All right, light heavyweight title rematch from last week. The Grandmaster versus Dean Malenko. And Grandmaster has won two weeks in a row. Still retaining his title. Triple threat. Al Snow, Big Boss Man, and Devon. Of course, I, of course, you know I'm cheer for. Aw, Al Snow won. But at least Devon did not get pinned. Benoit versus Scotty Too Hotty. That would have actually been hilarious if it was Grandmaster Sex versus Scotty Too Hotty for the light heavyweight title. <laughs> and of course, Benoit wins. I should have seen that one coming. A table match between Stevie Richards and Kurt Angle. I mean, I want to be a part of a table match or. Maybe more T maybe a TLC match. Stevie Richards. What was he trying to censor Kurt Angle for? Here's the feud of the night right here. Me versus Jeff Hardy. <laughs> what was Stevie Richards trying to censor Kurt Angle for? I wonder if he was, you know, eh, I don't know. Oh, oh, man, excuse me, guys. Oh. That's what happens when you have to work eight-hour eight, eight hour work nights. You have to stay up for a long time. Whew. I mean, seriously, why not book me in different kind types of matches? Like, I want to be a part of a table match. I mean, I'm a Dudley, for crying out loud. Table matches should be my specialty. Or how come it, maybe I should be a part of a TLC match? I mean, hey, the Dudley boys helped invent the TLC matches. Or book me in a Hell in a Cell match. Book me in anything. Besides, I mean, hey, tag team matches. Not just these regular singles matches. Please. All right, Jeff. Let's pick up where we left off. Unfortunately, I had my special during that brawl, so it's not necessarily picking up where we left off, I would think. But at least he's showing some... At least he's got some fatigue. <laughs> Lion Salt, gotcha. Ah, that was... It's only not even a two count. Wham! Lion Salt, gotcha. 
Gage goes up even further. It did not even get a single count. Man. Wah! <laughs> what the heck was that? What the heck was that? Dragon suplex. Oh, almost had him. That would actually have been pretty strange if I was able to clear that match within a minute. All right, so I got my special. Let's have some fun with him for a little bit. Cross power bomb. Get him outside of the ring. Get out of here. Sai Moon's all. Uh uh. Get to the groin. Ha! Oh boy, it's Matt. Come on, Matt. What are you going to do about it? What are you going to do about it, Matt? Soon and Sooner or later, one of my brothers is going to pop out. Ah! He actually hit me. Get, get back in there. Dragon suplex. His feet looks like they're on the rope. <laughs> they look like they were on the ropes. Don't want a diving head, but gotcha. Ow, face plant. Ah. Man, Jeff. <laughs> Taka Michinoku is the one that has to help me out. Of all people, it's Taka. Michinoku driver. Give him the no give him the Michinoku driver. <laughs> but you gave him the Michinoku driver instead. Man, come on. Come here, Jeff. Wah! I can't I can't stop using that clothesline. I just love that clothesline. 450. You know, I could have done a 450 off the top of the cage. But I don't know. I just think of something tells me a moonsault looks at uh, he's got a 450 too. No, not I mean he's got a 450 as well. I probably could have done it, should have done a 450 off the top of the cage. Tell been something to see, right? I mean, I've already done a diving moonsault off the top in the first cage match. I should have done a 450 off the second one. Knockout. I forgot I even. I forgot I even had the 450. Oh well. But for some reason, I think diving the diving moonsault looks like it's a bit more of a badass move. A bit more. This is probably just me saying this, but I, I like the moonsault better than the 450. I mean, sure, yeah, you go, you go, you spin, you know, you do a couple more spins. <laughs> Jeff is pissed off. I mean, you do like a 450 spin, forward flip spin. But unfortunately, moonsault is just a plain, uh, not even a 360. It's like a 270 backflip. All right, main event, Fatal 4-Way. Stone Cold Steve Austin, Triple H, Mankind, and Kane. It's going to be Triple H. <laughs> That's another match that Stone Cold has lost, but this time he did get pinned. All right, fourth week of, fourth week of October, SmackDown. And I'm not booked, so... Light Heavyweight title rematch yet again for three weeks in a row. But this time it's the first match on the card. Grandmaster Sex versus Dean Malenko for the Light Heavyweight title. That right, that title match has been going on for three weeks. When is it going to stop? Yeah, I'm sitting in a chair upset that I'm not booked. I think I should be. Oh, man. I can't stop yawning. It's easier said than done. Oh, took him three weeks to finally win his light heavyweight title back from Grandmaster Sexay, Dean Malenko. That's Mark Henry versus Test. It took Dean Malenko three weeks to get that title back.
All right, what's going to happen this time? It better, it better include me. At least book me in something. Book me in something. I was told I would have a special match tonight. While I'm here, who is my opponent? I would not book. I'm not booked on the card, and I'm standing in the entranceway. <laughs> yeah, I'm just probably just booked to cut a promo, and that's it. <laughs> Oh, Val Venus versus Goodfather. Just goes to show you that Val Venus, of course, this was right before he joined RTC, I think. And the Goodfather has already censored Val Venus. Even right before he joined the RTCs. <laughs> oh, man. Just didn't work out for him. Scotty Tuati defeated Eddie Guerrero. Next up is going to be Bubbery Dudley versus Crash Holly. Is going to be my brother, Bubba Ray. Up oh, to the back. To the back, to the back. Going to be going to the back again. Shane McMahon is asking David Lee Dudley and The Rock to interfere. <laughs> I can't believe Shane is actually trying to talk with The Rock. Okay, well, sure. I'll at least be booked in an interference with Shane. And this is like the second time that Shane, the third time a McMahon has asked me to interfere in their matches. Third time a McMahon has, has asked me to interfere? Well, it's the second time for Shane. But of course, the outcome is going to be the same no matter who, no matter which McMahon wants me to interfere in their match. Oh, does he realize who he's going up against? Well, we got a hardcore match between Steve Blackman and Farouk. And Farouk won. Doesn't Shane McMahon realize who he's going up against? He's going up against my brother, Devon. And it's obvious on whose side I'm going to be on. I'm obviously going to be on my brother's side. Not on Shane's side. Shane was never on my side to begin with. He just keeps persuading, saying, I'm the next big thing. I should be a part of the McMahon stable. But no, I say screw the McMahons. <laughs> Time for a little fun. Shane? Shane? You're going to regret having asked me to interfere in your match. Especially when my opponent is my brother. No chance of that's what you got. Yeah, yeah, Shane McMahon, who cares? You know, I kind of wonder how uh, this storyline even came to be. It's like the McMahons really want to try and mess up the Dudley's plans. Well, it's not going to work. Don't they realize that they don't mess with me and my brothers? Or unless it's going to be the Rock uh, coming out. Oh boy, man, I am so sorry. I just cannot stop yawning. It's a lot easier said than done for me. And <laughs> Shane, what is he doing? He's just dancing it off. Yeah, just dance it off, Shane. That sounds very, very, a very, very good idea indeed. Come on, Devon. Get him. There you go. Come on, brother. You're the hardcore champion for a reason. For a number of reasons. You got that hardcore title by kicking ass. 
How come you're not kicking that much ass right now? There you go. Come on. Keep doing that. Keep doing that. Don't just stay with it. Keep doing it. Come on. Devon. 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 Keeps doing the same stuff over and over again. Devon. 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 There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Give it to him. Get some moves on him. And yet, Shane is still proceeding to shake it off. Well, at least my brother was able to get a successful taunt in. There you go, brother. Come on. You're the hardcore champion. Kick some ass. What am I going to do in my run in? Yeah, here I am. Oh, hell yeah. It's not what they think. Not what he thinks it is. I'm helping my brother. You don't mess with the Dudleys there, pal. Come on, Devon. Pin him. Pin him. Pin him. Come on, you got him. You got him. What? I He did not get him? But how? That's nonsense. Get out of here, Shane. Man, you don't even sell it. And get out of here, Shane. Bam! Take one more of this. Get out of here. He's right next to the ropes. I can't do that. Come on, pin him, Devon. Pin him. Wah! Man, he just won't stay down. Stay down! <laughs> Brain buster. Oh boy, and here's Bubba Ray. Ha, ah, the Dudley boys! The Dudleys are all working together to defeat Shane McMahon. Unfortunately, Bubba Ray did little to no effect. It would have been a three-on-one handicap match, it looked like. Come here, Shane. Bam! Scissors kick again. Pin him, Demon! Pin him! Pin him! Come on, Devon, pin him. Oh, my word. Oh, he's out of it. Pin him. Go ahead, Devon, pin him. Go ahead, you got it. Oh, come on. Do I have to keep doing all the hard work around here? Yeah, turn him away from the ropes. There. Pin him. Wow, he doesn't even try to sell it either. Man. Shane. All right, famous sir. Are you gonna pin him, Devon? Come on, Devon, pin him. Oh my word! You don't take advantage, Devon. You don't take the advantage at all. Have to keep doing this kick all over again to knock him out. But yeah, he's not selling it. Do what you're supposed to do, Shane. Sell it. Act like it hurt. But I just want to have him turn to the good angle so he can pin him. Pin him, Devon. Come on. Okay, there you go. That's a pin. Yeah, we did it. There it is. Finally, man. Oh, testify, brother. Testify to the hardcore champion.
Whew. Whew. Finally, after all that, we finally win that match. I don't know about you, but I'm actually getting sick and tired of having to get asked for interference between the McMahons. I mean, what's up with that? Having to get constantly asked to interfere in the McMahon's matches. And it's Devon. He's getting attacked by two of the McMahon's and the one's just standing there talking. Yeah, just breathe it off, Devon. Breathe it off, buddy. Breathe it off, my brother. Just breathe it off. That's all you can do. All right, main event battle royal. Triple H, Kane, Shawn Michaels, and Vince McMahon. Got two members of DX in here. The winner, of course, is Vince McMahon, of course. All right, pay-per-view. The pay-per-view for October is No Mercy. WWF No Mercy. Main event again. Shane McMahon and Hardcore Holly. <laughs> what? So we're starting off with a hardcore match between Viscera and the Big Show. Demon Lake over his Grandmaster Sexay and I quit match for the light heavyweight title. But yeah, four pay per view main event matches in a row. Demon Lake over his Grandmaster Sexay, I quit match for the light heavyweight title. Will Grandmaster Sexay get his title back? Yes, he does. Dean Malenko says he quits. So, Grandmaster Sexay has taken back his championship. Shane McMahon? <laughs> Hardcore Holly is assaulting Shane McMahon. It's just going to keep building up to the main event. So this is what I get for screwing Shane out of his match last week. And uh, Hardcore Holly got screwed out of the uh, week in the first... No, the match during the first week. So I couldn't have my match against Hardcore Holly. So that's why these two are booked in a match against me. Alright, so we got yet another beauty contest. Ivory, China, Tristrash, and Lita. Wasn't it these, these uh, same four? The uh, first beauty contest we saw? I think it was Trish Stratus that won. If I remember correctly, I think it was Trish that won. If it was these same four. Okay, so there's China. Ivory. And Trish Stratus. And last but certainly not least, Lita. See who wins this time as Ivory. Yeah, I wonder who determines the winners for these beauty contests. Alright, so Ivory won that. Now we got an Iron Man match for the Intercontinental title between Eddie Guerrero and Val Venus. Seriously, when am I going to get booked in my title match? And Eddie Guerrero retains the title. A two referee match between Kane versus Kurt Angle, with Bubba Ray Dudley and Matt Hardy serving as special guest referees. So Kurt Angle won that match. Now we got Devon Dudley versus Crash Holly in an anywhere fall match with Vince McMahon as the special referee. I gotta go with my brother. My brother's a hardcore champion. Oh, testify! Testify, my brother. So at least my brother has held the hardcore championship for one whole month. <laughs> Shane McMahon provoking hardcore Holly. Just keep building up to the uh, feud there, boys. Just keep building up to the feud. How do you like me now? <laughs> so 
Now I got WWF No Mercy, which of course was that N64 game. You know, I never played that game. I I should try it. Same goes for WrestleMania 2000. I haven't played the N64 WWF games. An Iron Man match between Triple H and Stone Cold Steve Austin. Uh, no Way Out 2001, anybody? And Triple H won. Man, Stone Cold. All right, here we go. Fourth pay-per-view main event match. A triple threat match between myself, Shane McMahon, and Hardcore Holly. Where are they trying to decide who's the real hardcore man around here? Who's the one truly hardcore? I mean, everyone knows is obviously me. <laughs> but hey, I'm glad to put that title on the line. I mean, at least we got... At least we got, uh... Uh, shoot, what was I trying to... What was I talking about? Um... Oh, I was going to say, at least I have the title of being considered as the most hardcore. Well, I guess maybe not, because Devon has the hardcore title, so he is the most hardcore. <laughs> He's got the hardcore title, so never mind then. You know, speaking of hardcore title, I'm not even sure. If, I can't remember if Hardcore Holly actually held onto that belt. I mean, it would be very fitting. I mean, don't you think? I mean, Hardcore Holly... Holding the hardcore title. I can't remember if it did. I mean, I, I think it did. I, th I think. I'm not positive, though. Alright, here we go. Fourth pay-per-view main event. I mean, hey, at least I'm getting booked on the pay-per-views and the main, and main event pay-per-views. So that's... Better than nothing. That's badass is what it is. Alright, so let's go and get four pay-per-view matches in a row. Man, Hardcore Holly, get out of here. <laughs> kind of work together to get uh, Hardcore Holly out of there. Mood Salt! Of course, he didn't try to break up the count. Wah! What? I thought something happened there for a second. And there he goes. Come on, Shane, what are you going to do about it? <laughs> I just keep catching him while he keeps getting up, man. Come on. Alright, cross power bomb. Come on, baby. What are you gonna do about it now, Hardcore? Yeah, how do you like me now? Where you can't do anything about it. Ah, come on, I missed him. Ah! That'd be funny if I caught him in the air, though. Give him the scissors kick. Ah, oh, I didn't knock him out. I gotta get Hardcore Holly out of here. Get him out of here. Ah, rope break! Dang it! Stupid rope break. Get out of here, Hardcore Holly. Ow! Blow, blow from behind. Get out of here, Hardcore Holly. And look at this. Go Ow! Alright, then. Get over here. Moonsault! Come on! Yeah! Got him just in time. No, you don't, Hardcore Holly. Get out of here. Now, can I get it in time? 
Yes! <laughs> Just in time. All right, four pay-per-view main event matches won. Still, I mean, what's up with me being in, engaged in the triple threat matches for the pay-per-views? <laughs> I mean, so it's adding more people, no doubt about it. I mean, but come on, I'm actually getting a bit tired of going through the exact same match types throughout nearly the entire entire month. And of course, we're gonna end the show off by me, probably me, show you know, just shoving it, really shoving it in my opponent's faces. Yes, I am. <laughs> of course I'm satisfied with the victory. I'm satisfied by the fact that I've got four pay-per-view main event matches won. That's a record in itself. Even though I've got quite the bit of quite the record already, which is going on a completely hot winning streak. Alright, so that's how you close out the month of October. So not much really happened in the month of October. I almost got booked in all the weeks, but whatever. 